Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Talixian, and I'm going to show you how to get the Easter Egg on Shangri-La. First thing you're going to need to do is turn the power on, then head up here into the spawn. You'll need to press these buttons, there's four of them, so you need four characters. Can't do it with uh, any less, you need four. Uh, and then press those at the exact same time. Once that's done, head over here and you'll see this little button on that statue. Then you'll notice that these stones appear. Step on it and notice what symbol it is. Uh, there's two sections where these stones are. There's one here, and over by the waterfall bridge, there's an, a group of uh, stone slabs over there. So what you do is you step on it, look at what symbol it is, tell that to your partner over there, like that one was a half circle. So I told my partner, press a half circle now, or find the half circle, and once he finds it, he lets me know, stands on it, and then I stand on mine. And it's basically like a matching game, and you have to do that throughout the whole section for all of them and uh, match them all up. And if you like mismatch one, you have to start all over. So make sure you're doing it correctly. Now the next part, uh, I came over here. This is by the waterfall. There's a little slide here. And the other group is uh, on the other side of the map, which you'll see. And what needs to be done here is they need to stand, uh, all three of them need to stand on a little platform. And once they're all on it, I go down here, and that little switch right there, uh, it activates once they're all standing on it, and I go down. And yep, right there. Make sure they're all standing on that and not moving. And then it'll activate, and you're good to go for the next one. So right here, there's that orb. You need to use an explosive to knock it down, use the shrink gun to shrink it, and then knife it. And then uh, basically just follow it down. It'll go into the geyser down below, and then you'll uh, need to use a geyser, and then it'll put it in its place. And also make sure, uh, you, to activate each step, you have to uh, use the four stones in the beginning. That's how you get in between the steps. Uh, so here you have to activate that next switch four times, turn the valve four times, and then you'll notice gas will start appearing. One there, one there. What we have is the flamer zombie following us. You need the flamer zombie, so save a crawler and a flamer because the flamer doesn't count as a zombie type. Uh, there's another one there. And you'll need him to walk by each little uh, stream there that's popping out. And then once you see it flaming, that's like, uh, like that right there, that's when you know it's good. So once all four of them are hit, switch the switch, or hit the switch, I mean, uh, and then you're good to go. The next part of the easter egg is over here. You have four holes in a wall, so you need uh, spike more. We put four of them, even though I think you can do it with three, but uh, we put one in front of each hole, and we kept the flamer zombie to activate him, because you need something to set it off. So once he walks in front of all of them, uh, they will be plugged up, and you're good to hit the button that's in the water down below. You know, the button is right there in the middle of the water, and uh, that'll activate this one. The next one, once you uh, start it, there's a bunch of stone slates all scattered throughout the map. You have to knife each one of them. There's, uh, I think, three in the spawn, two right here, uh, a f two over by the mud pit, and three underneath. Uh, once they're all hit, you'll see that little uh, stick temple right there, at, right outside the map. Just throw an explosive and blow it up. Uh, the next part, I didn't film it, I forgot to, but uh, the little dials in the mud pit, you're going to use those numbers there. Basically, a U is 10, the line is 5, and the little dot is 1. Uh, you need to have 16, 1, 3, and 4. Uh, this next step, you need to hit the gongs to where all of these things are glowing. And then, as you saw, I shot that down, and uh, it gave me the dynamite. Once that, I, once you have the dynamite, you shoot that one I just shot, and there you go. It activates it, shrinks the meteor, and now you need to uh, activate Pack-a-Punch to get access to up here. Once the adventurers, or whoever you're helping, uh, Ask for the dynamite, give it to them, and then there you go. Once you get the meteor, you get all the perks, the achievement, and a few gamer picks. Uh, if you have any questions, please leave them below. 
uh, any of the instructions weren't helpful, you know, just leave a comment. Alright, well, there you are, and hope you guys enjoy. Later.